For the upcoming 80th anniversary of the Solomon Guggenheim Foundation next year, a media presentation was held at the Guggenheim Museum in New York, with several curators introducing the museum's upcoming exhibitions for later this year in 2017. In recent years, the Guggenheim has presented movements including the Futurists in Italy, the Zero Group in Europe, and Gutai in Japan. For the upcoming season, the museum will again look to the east with an exhibition titled Tales of Our Time. As the second exhibition of the Robert H. and Ho Family Foundation Chinese Art Initiative, Tales of Our Time will be showcasing new works in various mediums by seven artists from mainland China, Hong Kong, and Taiwan. At the press presentation, the co-curator of the show, Wang Xiaoyu, pointed out that instead of delivering a monolithic report on the state of contemporary art in China, Tales of Our Time is more about showcasing the featured artist's intellectual mindset, respective practices, and their aesthetic pursuits. It's important to recognize that the Guggenheim had a special purpose from its inception. It was, its mission was, as you know, to collect and exhibit art that was not just modern and not just new, but thoroughly radical. And I think that that radicalism is still with us today. You'll be hearing about an exhibition of something utterly new, which is commissioned through our Chinese art initiative supported by the Robert H. N. Ho Family Foundation which is a new demonstration, a redemonstration of the Guggenheim's long-standing commitment to the art of the moment. I'm the co-curator of the exhibition Tales of Our Time, featuring newly commissioned works by seven artists and collective. There are Char En Zhao, Kan Xuan, Sun Xun, Sun Yuan Peng Yu, Chen Qinghua, Yang Jiang Group, and Zhou Tao. These works cross a wide range of media, making their very debut. The show's title riffs on the name of a 1936 short story collection by Lu Xun, a key figure in modern Chinese literature. In the book, he retells ancient legends to reimagine history and illuminate modern problems of his time. Following the literary metaphor, Tales of Our Time considers a contemporary response I think for people really to engage the art and enjoy have an experience and really think about what the artwork wants to tell you um, is very important. And also we really want to take Chinese art out from this context as people consider it as a phenomenon. It is not. It is not a trend or anything. For more information from Sinovision English Channel, you can find us online at en.sinovision.net. Reporting for Sinovision Journal, I'm Jane Stone.